This is by far the most hilarious piece of gaming news I guess I have ever covered. Of course, the Dr. Disrespect drama has been ongoing. It's still going on. That's absolutely wild. But apparently now we got more. But wait! We got more, ladies and gentlemen. Now, you probably know. There's a video that I want to share with you guys. Like this video if you think there are two genders. Dislike the video if you think there are 5,000 genders. Now, we covered this, right? Where Insomniac narrative director said that we, we, we have lack of lgtv content in video games and i'm saying bro like where like where bro like every every character already made that had no problem this is the original lara croft design looks amazing looks perfect nobody complained and then it ended up getting that modern day audience you, you feel what I'm saying? <laughs> End up getting the 20,000 grams, uh, not grams, 20,000 tons of testosterone shot and see that happen. And apparently we also got proof here, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, so this is the Vol upcoming Wolverine game from Insomniac. You can see they really did that. You got the masculine jawline right there. You got the masculine shoulders right there. And, and yeah, and we're talking about Insomnia games here, guys. We're talking about Insomnia games. They're one of the best in business when it comes to graphics. You're telling me that they couldn't make the character look good? What are we talking? This looks like a PlayStation 2 modern day audience crap right there. And gamers are also waking up, right? Gamers have put together this beautiful collage where you can see all the men character. Looking amazing, looking pretty good, right? In game as well which tells you that they have the technology to take a male actor and basically put them in the game as as them so you see that but the female characters however it's pretty hard to do that the fable character you can see that spider-man 2 character mary jane in this picture looks kind of odd but in game we all saw her she looks abysmal right they have changed the character model so badly absolutely insane Fast forward to now, because of this Dr. Disrespect situation, I was a little bit late, but honey, you need to wake the hell up, roll it. Ladies and gentlemen, it is time to talk about a practice that I have been actively against in the gaming industry for a while now, and I'm going to continue to talk about it every time that I see it, because quite honestly, it's a ridiculous practice. The fact that these companies can take your money for a product that they sold you yeah. and then later down the line change that product completely yeah. due to active. The product got a 50% reduction right now. So this is before, right? Wait for the after and then not give you your money back it's ridiculous right like you buy a certain skin you buy a certain product expecting it to be that way forever and then they change it and they tell you well tough luck we yeah. have your money anyway we have a post here from endymion over on and, and people are saying no ass no cash and they have reduced the assets as you guys can or you will see in a second right you see the assets here but then it's like you see brie larson so they have given her a brie larson treatment and mind you that it was pretty fine so uh, but, but but later on after selling you the product they have nerfed the <laughs> they have nerfed the burnout of the character bro. <laughs> this, this is this is why i said it was hilarious because i cannot take it serious though you feel what i'm saying but of course we know the reason of course we know why they did it they want to blur the lines between men and female yeah right this is exactly why they're doing it but but wait for it this is not the climax with Twitter and it says Call of Duty nerfs the boy's firecracker skin by reducing her assets. Don't you <laughs> love it when you buy something and they go in later and change it? People should get yeah. a refund. Companies shouldn't be allowed to do this sort of thing. It's disingenuous. <laughs> Oh yeah, everybody needs to get needs to get that get 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 get, get the, the, their money back, bro. This was false advertising. You know, call of no booty is what they they made her feel like, right? No, people are saying no ass, no cash. I agree. Run. Uh oh. Now, I 100% agree with this notion. I mean, just look at what they did, okay? I want to take all the woke nonsense out of it. I want to take the activism port out of it. Don't get don't get me wrong. We're going to talk about that. I want to take all of this out of it, and I just simply and strictly want to talk about the business practice because this yeah. business practice... Yeah, if you forget about the assets here, right? Let's, let's talk about the product at hand here. The product was sold. The goods were sold completely intact right people did like the product and, and listen man 
I'm gonna be the first guy here to say that, bro, like, buying microtransactions in terms of, like, uh, these skins for $20, $30 each, right, in video games that don't matter, I mean, that's wild to me, that's wild, I, I, I wouldn't, right, I personally wouldn't, maybe in the future when I have, like, all the money in the world, like, like, other people that buy it, maybe then I would, okay, maybe then, okay, but for now, I ain't rich like that, okay? I'm a, I'm a brokey, okay? <laughs> Maybe I need to get my bread up because people are always buying these skins. Maybe I'm the only one. Maybe I'm the only one. Uh, am I the only one? Let me know, man. But okay, yeah, some people are like, okay, I'm gonna buy one skin here, one skin there. Yeah, I wanna live a little, right? Live a little. Okay, fair, right? Like, whatever, right? You do you, boo boo. But in this situation, I'm a brokey. I know I'm a brokey. So I ain't buying it. That's my, my thing, though perfectly fine here uh with me uh if you want to buy it, uh, you buy it perfectly fine with me too but uh in this situation they were selling a product and once they have sold that product for maybe i'm not sure how much it was i'm assuming either 20 dollars or 25 or maybe even 30 <laughs> maybe even 30 dollars or maybe even more right and they sold that product and it was good but after you purchase it's like they nerf it after after selling you they then they then nerf it like crazy to me absolute crazy to me it's like i wish i could say psych right now it, yeah you remember that friendly bbc all right yeah the bbc bundle imagine they nerfed that too and, and yeah bro like if you're gonna nerf these assets you might want to nerf that asset too right like what are we talking of course i'm uh joking around with that but but holy crap but but that skin is real that's what activision did bro like not my opinion though that's what activision did this is inherently anti-consumer and there's going to be people out there i promise you oh trust me they're going to be out there the same people who are telling you oh just sign up for your psn account stop being mean to the big daddy corpo yeah those people they're going to be out here disingenuously telling you oh all you want to do is fap to the <laughs> character when you're really trying to sit down and have a genuine adult conversation about bad what? business practice in the gaming industry so let's get into this video guys but of course before we Bruh, we're not 12 years old here okay come on no like you're, you're talking about a teen pubescent kid that would see and just fap now nah, it's not even about that bro it's not about that of course the everybody knows the reason right the reason is simple they want they, they're doing this is because like they want to blur the lines between a man and a female uh, men and female right in this instance they want to they want to make you believe that we're both the same we're not both the same though you know men are superior in some aspects of life and females are superior in other aspects of life collectively when we come together we form a powerhouse simple as that and they want to break that they they want you to, to believe that yeah we're we're kind of like like the same no we're not the same we're not the same bro we're not the same and that's okay that's the beauty about it that's the beauty about it that we're not the same it's okay to be different it's completely fine you, you feel what i'm saying like the video if you agree dislike if you disagree though but we do if you are new here just consider hitting like that subscribe, subscribe but i would like. greatly appreciate it and like the video to push us out into that youtube algorithm like now and subscribe, like if and subscribe. you guys can't see for whatever reason maybe you're just listening to me audio wise but they completely reduced the booty of firecracker and they made it from uh you know an obvious typical female that she actually is to essentially the poke Pokemon Go treatment. They gave yeah. her the Pokemon Go body type, uh -oh. the uh -oh. androgynous body type. They completely removed that ass because, quite frankly, some DEI consultancy firm or some woke activist inside of the actual company decided this was a great idea. Let's do this. You know what I'm yeah. saying? And the problem for me is it's uh -oh. not about the removal of the ass, okay? <laughs> it's simply about the practice and what it represents. It's the practice and what it represents. The reason they did it, that's the main thing here. It's not about, like, uh, any other stuff. The, we know the reason. That's where we at, right? Like, the reason they did it, that's, like, what the actual hell. And, and I'm, I suppose, like, the actress that they use, I suppose what she thinks, it's like... She, yeah, like, they must have scanned the, the, the model and whatnot, and they're like, let's have that model. Unless I'm wrong, unless I'm wrong, I not I have not seen the boys' uh, movie, okay? Uh, on that part, I'm, lo I'm lost, uh, absolutely. Maybe this is just, like, a fictional character, but still doesn't change the change it. If it's based on a real character, let me know in the comments. If it's on a, if it's, if it's, if this one is made on a real character, I, I wonder what she's thinking right now. They're like, okay, so Activision, like... Like, so you really looking at my ass like that? Like, Phil, you, you, you only care about that? So, because you you nerfed it, right? Like, you removed it, like, completely. And, yeah, that, that's disrespectful, though. That's disrespectful, though. But if it's, but if it's like, a virtual, uh, a fictional character, yeah, it's not disrespectful, but we know the reason why they did it. 
Zeds, for me, the biggest issue is that you have these companies selling you things, right? They're taking your money for a product. So in this yeah. in this case, they took your money for a female skin that had a nice butt, nice whatever, firecracker based on the character from the boys, whatever. They decided to then nerf that, yeah. essentially <laughs> remove her entire feminine physique, yeah. turned her into the Pokemon Go androgynous character. Yeah, like the Brie Larson. It's one thing to sell the character from the beginning like that, but it's completely another thing when you have <laughs> when it, it, to sell a character with S and ask for your cash. Oh, that, that rhymed actually. <laughs> Selling my character with the S, ask you about the cash wait what what what, 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 what? I, i'm not a rhymer but but like that 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 actually rhyme right there like the video for that I guess right i mean look at this look at this even tracer from overwatch is probably as as uh thick as this woman let's just say and okay. you guys remember what they did to tracer now they do this they take your money they sell you a skin and then later down the line due to activism they want to change it that shit has to be illegal that shit has to not be allowed they should not be able to take your money and be able to do whatever the fuck they want with it after the fact that is ridiculous you are purchasing a skin in the game and yeah. you are buying a product as it was and then for them to completely change it it's not even like they changed the color of her shirt it's not like they changed the color of her shoes no they straight up androgenized her yeah. they reduced her leg even her thighs are Crazy. not thick anymore like Crazy. she's got the pokemon go treatment that's the only way that i could possibly explain this to you and we have so many people calling this out as well we have grums saying why did oh, they have to man. flatten her butt was it a threat to all women does having yeah. a flat butt make more women feel safe to play call of duty well even though i know grums is being sarcastic it's not about that obviously yeah, it yeah. is quite simply just about season one versus <laughs> Oh my god, bro. But uh, to be fair though, on this one, you see the difference. You see the difference, but it's not that bad. It, it But it's bad when, from a different angle. And it's not even about this, right? It's because the reason they did it. The reason, that's the worst part, right? That, that That's why, like, I guess he's making that video. That's why I'm talking about it. That's why everybody's talking about it. And yeah, I know I'm a little bit late on it, but still, the, the topic at hand it's never too late for it, right? The topic at hand is the, the most important part. The reason they did it is just wild. The Wait trans gaze. That's what it is. They want trans uh, females uh, to better see themselves because God knows they don't have the genetic capability to look like real females. So they need these characters to be as androgynous as possible. And they can't really androgynize the male characters. So they're going to androgynize the female characters because they know that the male characters are the ones that are bought and paid for the most so i just think that this is the most ridiculous thing just looking at this picture it is so obvious what they did to the character and again it's not just the butt too they made her legs thinner overall too they All gave that, yeah. her the pokemon go treatment removed her hips removed her boot M made her man made her a man made her man flattened her out everywhere and again i do find it kind of funny that he's trying to say oh does it make you feel safe because that's the that's the excuse that they'll give you they'll try to talk about oh does it make you feel safe you know we're we're doing this for the safety of gaming i mean look yeah. at this they gave her the tracer treatment even tracer at least has boobs for the most part but what i remember what they did to tracer's ass man holy shit i remember so them. so so uh, okay I, I don't know about it right so does that mean uh, they did the same thing to that character as well bumbleclad so you mean like you mean that uh, she also had the ass but now they remove the ass okay meltdown that people had over that and the Bruh. fact that they're doing it with this character Bruh. now too just goes to show that this is going to be a common theme here Bumble if i was a player of call of duty which thankfully i am not not that much anymore uh only if people ask me to play and even then i don't really play but if i was a hardcore player of call of duty the last thing that i would do from this day moving forward is buy skins because if you mean to tell me i can pay this exorbitant money for a skin yeah. especially this particular skin that was probably expensive is based off of a licensed character oh it oh it was okay licensed character but but still like fictional character or based off a real person uh let me know in the the comments if you if you know because uh yeah I'm, i i don't know so I'm, I'm just gonna keep it real like i i don't know i don't know but 
You mean to tell me that I can pay you tons of money to have this skin, and then six months, five months, however long it is down yeah. the line, you can completely change the entire skin, and I'm just supposed to eat it, right? I'm just yep. supposed to sit here and be like, yep, this is a great business practice. This is so... Uh, and, 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 yeah, how many times we have seen some like that happen? Horizon Forbidden West, of course, it wasn't too bad, though. But I remember when people, when Horizon Forbidden West was first coming out, and a lot of people were like actually making her look like, let me actually, oh man, do I really wanna, no oh, man, no oh, man, come on man, come on man. But, but I remember like people were making uh, the character extra like McDonald, McDonald's if I, they were like beefing her up, like, but not like m m muscular wise, but like actually beefing her up. Uh, uh, and people were talking about it. I remember that, right? That was like, the first time I ever coming across in terms of like this crap coming to video games of course it was happening a little bit here and there before too but it wasn't like so obvious and now they're making it super obvious this is why people are talking about it if it wasn't this obvious then yeah you're gonna hear some people talk about it doesn't mean they're right or wrong Hey, they don't like it. They don't like it. Everybody has the right to criticize a product Everybody has a right to dislike a product for whatever the reason whatever the reason might be they don't like a product They don't like the product simple as that. Okay, everybody has the right for that But I remember that right and people were making her fat and all that and I remember if I'm not uh, if I if I'm not mistaken Like I, I covered that story and a lot of people were defending it and understandably a lot of people were saying that well She's gonna be fighting a war. She's in a war like setting So of course she's not gonna have like a makeup on she's not gonna be like all pretty and cute uh, Understandable and that that reason flied with me at that time But of course the reason they started doing that was because of the woke points Horizon Forbidden West Still though, still, 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 wasn't too bad though. Then we got like this Star Wars, this is like, now, now, you see the actress? The actress looked uh, gorgeous, and see what they did, like, bruh. Bruh. Man jawline, she don't even have that masculine of a jawline in real life. Uh, and you see the haircut, the way it is, and the character, the way it looks, insane, insanity. Fable, oh, everybody saw the Fable character. Spider-Man 2, in this picture, like I was saying earlier, does look alright, but in all reality, let me actually show you guys this. <laughs> yeah, man, this is how she looked like. Uh, okay, am I gonna find that thumbnail? I mean, yeah, this, <laughs> this one right here. Let me actually open the thumbnail uh, for you guys here. Open YouTube thumbnail here. Boom, boom. Bim, bam, boom. Yeah, so this is how she looked like in-game. And... and the original Spider-Man, if I can find it, Spider-Man 1 versus 2, uh, Woke, or Mary Jane. Yeah, and, and this is taken, okay, now this is a little bit modified here. Mary Jane. So, Spider-Man 1, yeah, here. Okay, still, in this picture, she don't look too bad, though. You feel what I'm saying? Doesn't look too bad. Like, let me actually open it. Oh, it doesn't open. My bad, guys. But, but you, see, uh, you see what I mean, right? Like, this one was the first version. And yeah, she's modest with the modest clothing perfectly fine. Nobody complained about it and she looks pretty and Modestly that's beautiful, right? Like modestly she doesn't need to be because everybody's like oh man You guys want all the video game characters to be like stellar blade if we get all of them We're not gonna complain because we're men, but also we we understand like you guys can have different characters and that's fine. Your modesty is also beautiful Absolutely though, and this one was perfectly fine. Why change it? Why change it? And it, people were also talking about it was a self insert. And yeah, you look at it like I don't want to, uh, I don't want the video to auto play. But yeah, this is what I'm talking about where my mouse at, right? So yeah, look at that. Like, goddamn. And, and yeah, the Kyle. Of course, Kyle. <laughs> of course, the homie Kyle is going to make a video about it. So you see the first one and the second one. You see. But, but I have to agree, like, on the second picture in this shot, she looks kind of fine. But you see the jawline, the jawline is still visible there. It's a manly jawline that you can see. Uh, so, yeah, around this time, everybody was like, okay, we know the reason why they're doing it. A and uh, you see this? It is very, very obvious as to why y'all suckers have been doing it. And now everybody's seeing it and nobody can defend it. We recently had a dev that leaked uh, the, the, the agenda as well, right? Like even, uh, and that dev, I'm not sure if you guys actually saw that video. I will link you that in a second. A dev came forward and he exposed why this is happening. Uh, an actual artist, an actual dev, he said that, yeah, like, I don't want to give gamer get people fuel. Basically, he was talking about 
people like you and I, uh, people that actually speak out against the, against this crap. I guess that's what he meant. But he said himself that I don't want to give gamer get people more fuel. But it's obvious. Like, yeah, I was one of those guys. I'm talking about him. I'm paraphrasing him. I was one of those guys that would actually, you know, uh, send some female characters that were gorgeous uh for a design and my designs that i would send that look good would be changed and formed to something like this i'll link to that video in a second and you're gonna see that okay but but check this wait for it uh, in the favor of consumers it's not even funny like no no that's not what this is and again you're gonna have people disingenuously trying to represent this as oh you just want to fap the characters you guys are all yeah. fucking pathetic the ones that oh, try yeah. to make that as an excuse that you just want to fap the characters because you fucking know damn well that that's not what this is about for the majority yeah. of people this yeah, is yeah, quite yeah. simply about the fact of bad consumer practices you are inherently anti-consumer by doing this if you want to do this to fire cracker you can do this with a separate skin you can sell a <laughs> secondary skin that will have all the flatness you possibly want in political correct yeah like uh you can have the actual version and on top you can have a modern modern audience one too this to go with it that's what you could have done but instead you are changing the thick skin into the flat androgynous skin and expecting people to be okay with it no yep. nobody and this is that video that i was talking about a dev came forward exposed it and uh, you know what his uh credit uh, cre uh what, what's the one he, he has credibility is what i was saying check out this video on the screen it's gonna open up your third eye if you've already seen it then check out the video on the left because apparently new stuff has come forward pictures receipts about dr disrespect yeah it's crazy check it out